Hello everyone, welcome back with RSPS video. Today we're back on Stellar SPS, one of the most high brunskit private servers of that brand new custom server with over 200 every single day. We are gonna be doing a sort of server to today. I'm very excited, a huge update as well releasing this weekend. So if you guys never checked on Stellar, make sure to do so. The links are down below. And fast things fast, the giveaway is gonna be one of these beautiful owner capes right here to one lucky winner to celebrate the brand new update coming out. These guys have been working so hard on the server, it's absolutely beautiful to see and make sure turned out there's a massive giveaway for this lovely one cape right here all you have to do for that one is like the video comment change your name down below and be subscribed to my channel i would say let's get right into the video First things first, I'd like to showcase you the brand new owner set you, the new Bastard Slot coming with a new update. Looks absolutely beautiful. This one is going to be released this weekend, so get hyped. The owner grind will be real for that one. Looks very nice. Compared to the owner one, it looks a bit more spikier, a little bit bigger horns. The wings a bit bigger as well, and the orange color looks very, very amazing with a dark black right there. Top freaking notch. Also, ladies and gentlemen, there is a giveaway going on in the giveaway section that you guys do not want to be missing out. It's 50 owner dots to three lucky winners, so... Make sure to sign up on that one by clicking on this bad boy right here. You might be asking, what are the owner darts? The owner darts are the only thing that I can attack the owner boss, which you guys can find right here. And the owner boss is a very cool concept, actually. You get these darts, and you can throw them on them. For our chance of these items right here, which includes also the owner pieces, which are super, super nice. And uh, yeah, definitely make sure to be signing up on that giveaway as well, because it's super worth it. So today, we're going to do a sort of server tour. We're going to go through every content piece. I hope you guys are excited from the beginning all the way to the end game. And here we go. The first thing you guys want to do when you guys log in is obviously the column column train zone right there. When I go ahead and do the different NPC tools, you have to go ahead and do it. Get yourself 99. Be beautiful in... Uh, Prayer. And also what's really cool on Stella is that you guys will be getting yourself the starter tokens right here that you guys can open for a starter shop right here. Get the herbal bow that's very AP early on. You can go ahead and get try some other upgrades as well. But honestly, the herbal bow is what you want to get. From the ref code, you'll also be getting collection logs, so go out and do that. So before we go into teleports or anything, I would like to show you a couple interface which are super nice. So the first ones is a uh, column column NPC task. So I type that in. This beautiful interface will be opening right there. You go ahead, you start farming. These are super easy to do, to be honest. And you guys see you're going to get some nice rewards for doing them. The further we go, the more bonds you're going to be getting. It's very free to play. There is people with ten thousands of dollars in rank with free to play, which is so freaking amazing. So you guys will be able to play the entire game free to play as well which not a lot of custom servers actually offer that and i think that's one of the reasons why there's so many people enjoying stella then we have column column call right there type that in and the collection logs will be opening super clean as well for completing collection logs you guys will be getting as well a lot of freaking bonds every zone every npc every monster you guys will be farming will have some crazy rewards that is super nice to see and as you can see right here you're gonna be getting 50 dollars right there for literally one collection log Freaking hundred dollar bond and so much more. So you definitely want to be checking out the beautiful collection logs. And another one which is super important is column column BIS. So for best in slot right there. And here goes we're finding from the best helmet, which obviously right now is the owner helmet. But with the owner U coming out, that one will be placed obviously above that one right there. Then we have the ultimate one, which is by the way absolutely amazing as well because that one is a full free to play set as well. I'm gonna go into that in a second. Then you guys can literally scroll all the way to the worst one down there. If you hover over the items, you guys will be seeing all the beautiful uh, drop rates as well as stats, which is pretty fucking awesome. There is a shit ton of globals that you guys do not want to be missing out. May, for example, is one of the most OP ones. So you definitely want to go to Column Column May whenever that one spawns. Titan is the best one. Then we have the Mass Boss as well. And so many other ones that you guys do not want to be missing out. And as you can see, fully off peak, there are so many people as well already farming them. Alrighty, the beautiful May is that right here. And we've got ourselves some crystals and everything, which is pre a pretty good point. Because I would like to talk about column, column, PAP right there. So in column, column, P, that's the upgrade interface, super clean. We've got the weaponry all the way to Bastion Slot right here. Then you've got the armory, and we also have the miscellaneous ones from right here, including also the AOE or position unique system on Stella, where you guys get these bad boys, and then you guys will be able to have, to have bigger radius and more AOE power. That is very nice. God's Blessing right there is also custom items for the custom prayers. You need in total seven, one scroll for each of these bad boys, and for the final one, which is super OP, you need three scrolls in total. For that one, you need unlimited prayer scrolls as well as stellar tax bags. Now, that's the very interesting part right here. The armory one has its own unique category set. That is super cool. I love it. So, you have the expert set, you have the maniac set, you have the Olympus set, and you also have the ultimate set right here. 
What does that mean exactly? So each zone you guys will be farming from the expert one right here, each drop you're going to be getting can be forged into the beautiful category gear right there. So you want to be farming all the beautiful sets right here from each boss if it's dropping wood, and then you guys will be able to forge them in column, column, PAP right there. That works for the expert zone, for the expert set, for the manic, for the manic zone, as well as for the Olympus zone. The brand new one right here, which is actually a very fucking good set, 150,000 in stats, and then all these pieces can be forged into the ultimate sat. So you take the expert one, you take the Olympus one as well as the manic one, and you guys will be getting the ultimate one at 80% success rate. So that should be actually pretty easy upgrades right there. And you guys will get 175k in stats, literally free to play. And that is also definitely part of like the entire server right here. So from the progression content wise, you have a couple of different options. The first one is to go ahead and grind through the beautiful zones so control that or column column zones it doesn't really matter and then you guys will be farming these bad boys from right here these are also these zones right here beginner medium hard and expert manic and olympus one this is for the free to play best of slot set right here the final ones that you guys will be forging then you have also blood slay which is super freaking nice to go for the beautiful blood genie pants right there that's a very interesting concept as well i'm going to explain it right now. so you click on the slayer skill you teleport to your masters right there and then you have the normal ones and after you guys spend an x amount of blood slayer backs you guys will be unlocking blood slayer here is the blood slayer shop here is the blood slayer master then you also have the perks ready that you guys will be able to unlock for your account super interesting bonus damage bonus drop rate blood bags blood slayer michelin awards all of these can be unlocked right here through the interface and there's also the devil slayer that you guys will be able to grind which is sort of like the next thing after the beautiful blood slayer if we go to column column forges you guys will be able to check out a couple of custom patch right there which are super super interesting uh which are actually grinded a lot through the blood slayer route right there so one of the very important items divine aura right here it's a very nice upgrade that you guys want to go for the perfect eye beautiful necklace as well as ring as well as the bar super super nice and then we have the Kellen pat right there which is a very pat nice pat right here which is the forge of all the different eve evolutions how do you get the eve evolutions you want to get the eve pat and these crystals that you get from all the globals i've mentioned before so you get these three bad boys right here and you guys will be able to forge into Kellen pat right here um the Kellen pat after that one can will will be needed for this upgrade right here for the Shenren pad. So that one requires the Yugi Moto pad, which is from Raids, which we're going to have a look into that in a second. Plus the Kellen, plus requirements to get the Shenren pad. After that one, you'll be forging the Blood Shenren, the Blood Genie pad that you guys get one in a thousand rate at doing Blood Slayer. Plus the Shenren pad, plus all these items right here into the Blood Shenren pad right here. Super nice how they've, the storyline is based on these ones right here, making Raids. Blood Slayer, very, very interesting, as well as the Global Bosses right there. Then we have the Stellar Diamond as well, which is a very OP diamond that you always want to be getting. I've always told these items will all be going into the beautiful um, PAP as well, but we'll see about that. Uh, looks very, very clean as well, and these are the two interfaces you guys want to be playing around. Obviously, there's a shit ton of other interfaces right here, but these are the most important ones. Back teleports right here, so you have a lot of zone grinds, Blood Slayer, and now we go into the mini games as well. After you complete 30,000 beautiful Druga kills right here you guys will be able to go into the galactic prison right here that's like the zone extension right here you go ahead kill this bad boy and then you guys will be getting some really nice rewards including best and slot pad another diamond which is even better than the stellar diamond which i'm sure in the future will be a forge for these two and also black god's blasted right there as well so after you complete the beautiful uh, prison, you guys can go into the Olympus zone. That's a requirement for the final Olympus zone right there. Then we also have the owner boss I've mentioned before. There is a Dragon Ball Z mini game. There is the Stellar Dream, League of Legends raid, the Yu-Gi-Oh raids. That's the one you guys want to be farming for the Yu-Gi Moto pad right there, as well as Bonds and a lot of other amazing rewards and a couple of other beautiful mini games. More raids will be coming in the future. Um, stay tuned for that one, and that is pretty much the progression for you right now. There is a lot of new forged items coming out this week weekend as well it's gonna be very interesting another thing i would like to show you really quick is the luxury shop right so this is an item sync mechanic right here you guys will be able to sell these items for half the price in so after you sell them you get luxury tokens you guys will be able to purchase these items right here including the 1.5 drop rate booster as well as the 1.5 damage booster which are best in the slot in here they're really really nice i've heard there's also another booster 1.75 coming out forging these two into one as well on the next update don't Take my word, I was just told about that. I'm not sure if it's going to be releasing, but this is some very great updates coming out very soon. So get excited for that one. Join Stella with the links down below right now. Every new player gets nice starter packs. So make sure you're claiming their full code. Go ahead, start from the starter zone, and then Blood Slayer. Go for the zones grind, and just get your gear up and enjoy the game. It's super nice, endless grind, super many 
content creators making content in here, so check them out as well. If you have any questions, just ask this to see. There's always people answering in here, and you'll have a lot of fun. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'll see you all around. Big content update releasing this weekend. Get excited for that one. Have a good one. Enter the giveaway, and peace out.